All right, we have this problem here. Let us translate as we go through. James spends $24 on five pencils and a sketch pad. Okay, so I know he's going to spend a total of $24. And he's going to spend it on five, five pencils. Put five pencils here and a sketch pad. So five pencils plus a sketch pad. Sketch pad. All right, each pencil costs the same amount. Okay, that's telling me that if the pencil costs um, P dollars, then that means I can multiply it by five. So five P is what I should be writing. All right. Um, the sketch pad costs nine dollars. Oh, now I know the sketch pad is nine dollars. So I'm going to substitute in the word sketch pad for nine dollars. And we write everything else. Write an equation that can be used to figure out the cost of one pencil P. Okay, well, I know that five pencils plus nine dollars, this is the cost of the pencils, plus nine dollars, will equal twenty-four dollars, uh, because that's the total. So the equation is five P plus nine equals twenty-four. Five pencils plus nine dollars for the sketch pad will equal a total of twenty-four dollars, which is what James has to spend on the five pencils and the sketch pad. So please be very careful in uh, identifying what you're talking about and being very specific with the number attached to the unit through multiplication or simply addition.